Hey everyone, it's Kelsey and today I'm going to be doing my weeks 33 and 34 of pregnancy update. I am starting to get very, very nervous because I'm getting very close, but I'm also getting so excited to meet him. We have had quite a bit go on, like Christmas and all that, during this last little week, eh, this last two weeks, I guess. And we also had our shower, which was really exciting. So, got a little bit to update on, not a whole, whole ton, but I am currently 34 weeks and 5 days, and I'm feeling it. <laughs> My main, I guess, symptom that is still going on, that was going on, um, is I have a lot of crotch pain. Like, a lot. Um, pretty much all the time. And if I would say one symptom that's kind of stuck with me from second trimester till now, it would be the crotch pain which is not a good symptom but hey we're just rolling with it <laughs> but I am almost 36 weeks which means I will get to have or almost 35 weeks but um, my next appointment will be almost 36 weeks and I'll get to have my ultrasound after that and go to the hospital and tour the hospital and do all that stuff but at my last appointment they just did the same thing as always and just measure me and weighed me my blood pressure was a little high. Um, I also had the kids with me at the appointment, which I normally don't. And sometimes it can just be a little stressful. Um, so maybe that's why my blood pressure was high. Not 100% sure. Just keeping an eye on it. I did have kind of a, I don't know, an event, <laughs> I guess. I went to my sister's house and Elm was there. And it was whenever... My niece was in the hospital and the dog needed to be walked, so I walked the dog. She didn't ask me to walk the dog, I just walked the dog. And he decided to go crazy and, yeah, try to jerk me to the ground, do all kinds of stuff, because he's a big, like, 80 pound dog. And normally he does really good with me. I don't know what happened, but anyway, <laughs> after that experience, which was the day after I filmed, I think my last update um i'm pretty sure that the baby dropped because the pain that i was talking about in my ribs and the burning sensation it was gone um and i could physically see that it looked like he had dropped so i think he dropped and now is down lower um that evening i definitely was in a lot of um uncomfortableness like pain like my entire like my crotch was really really painful um and my lower back but I wasn't having contractions or anything he was still moving around good um nothing you know nothing alarming on his end just symptoms were very very rough that day um so I could just been keep an eye on it and I've been to the doctor since then and everything's fine but it was definitely scary <laughs> because I I would prefer him to cook a little bit longer and but if he were to be born now we, we should still be okay but I just prefer him to cook for a little longer and the event in general was kind of traumatic because uh, I didn't want to fall down or hurt myself or him hurt the other dog that he was trying to chase um all of that <laughs> but I am doing fine uh, nothing really big resulted from it other than him dropping down, which has been nice on my rib section because <laughs> it's not been hurting, but it was kind of scary that that's kind of what happened and then he dropped. Um, but I'm all good. <laughs> then what else happened? We had Christmas, um, and New Year's, but honestly, I've been having about the same symptoms. I have been having contractions. Sometimes they'll happen a little bit more often, which is to be expected. Um, one thing that did happen last week, so in my 33rd week, um, I started um, producing colostrum. Um, it doesn't happen a whole lot, but little bits every day. Um, that's already coming in. So that was just, it was kind of a crazy, whatever it first happened, I was like, whoa. Like, this is what my body's built to do and it's doing it but still at the same time it's just like a weird experience but that did happen which was kind of really cool <laughs> like really cool actually 
Um, I'm trying to think what else went on because I don't take notes because if I take notes then I sit here I'm just reading it off and it's just I just things that I need to like I want to remember I feel like I will remember for two weeks if I don't then I guess it wasn't really that important but yeah we've had lots of movement um, and he's definitely started rolling a lot more which is to be expected because he's out of room still out of breath as you can tell but yeah, that's pretty much all that's went on other than the shower. And if you watched the shower video, then you saw kind of some little clips of it. Um, we didn't get to have as many people come as we had planned, but we did have a couple people there. So it was a lot of fun. And I loved the way everything turned out looking. Uh, yeah, I just was so excited about that. And we also revealed the name on YouTube this week. And if you haven't seen that video, I'll link that. But his name, if you've not seen it, is Gideon Lane. And I will do a video showing why um, we named him that because we've had a couple requests for that and asking. And it's kind of a detailed thing to not really be able to message back. So I will be doing a video hopefully soon of why we named him that. But that is all. I am starting to flip out because we're moving and getting ready to have a baby and I feel like nothing is prepared but if he comes now we're fine we have a bassinet we have clothes we have things that we you know a car seat so we will be okay <laughs> but we won't definitely don't have like a nursery set up or anything because we're moving and yeah it's a little stressful <laughs> but that's all I have I will show you my bump and then I will see you in our next video and update <laughs> all right here is the belly he is definitely growing i am still at the same weight um i didn't gain any from appointment to appointment which is good because i gained a lot <laughs> there at that point so still gained i think about 13 pounds there's the belly and then from the front and then from this side but there he is if you enjoyed this video give it a big thumbs up and i'll see y'all my next one bye